Congratulations, you've made it to the final video out of three. The first video you will have created your custom holocoat design and the file. That file in video two was then imported to your Magic Art support account. And in this final video, we'll be running through actually installing the final holocoat file into your Magic Art printer. So I've already received my email to confirm that my feature key is ready. And I'll now jump across into my Windows PC where I'm already logged into my Magicard support account. And over on the left here, I'll come over to your Holocoat. We'll see in here the Holocoat I created. We can preview that file as well. And because the status we see is generated, I can now click the download button and confirm that that's the file and download. I can now close the window. So my file is downloaded. To get the file into the printer, come down to the search and we'll start typing control panel and then choose view devices and printers. See my printer here. I'm going to right click on that, come down in the options to printing preferences. And then in the first screen, you'll see down here we've got printer upgrades. So we'll enter the printer upgrades section and then manage holocoat. Be patient with this because what it will actually do is try and retrieve the online catalogue. If the online catalogue did find an existing holocoat, then it will appear here in the right hand available column. If it didn't, it doesn't matter, you can just come to offline holocoat, select the file that you've just previously downloaded, open that. So I've selected here, because the little arrow is over slot one, this is assuming that's the where I want to install that file, which it is. So my holocoat download was complete. And now, when I look at slot one, I just gave it a refresh there by going away and back onto it. We'll see that that's my Holocoat image that I installed. OK that. And OK. So to make sure that the Holocoat is active, come over to the card front, or card back as well if you're having Holocoat on the back and then security options and we can see in the top I've got slot one is the one I put my custom holocoat into it's the correct image you can return back to manage holocoat with the button here but this one is all ready to print so we can OK that apply and OK at this point you may wish to do a quick test print to double check the holocoat printed you can print that from whichever application you're normally printing from. If it helps, you can right click on the printer icon, printer properties, and then print the test page. You can hear my printer started up. This will just print the Windows test page. And my card's printed, just the Windows test page. And I'll try and get you a more close-up shot of this but I can see my Holocoat logo is on there perfectly. Okay so I really hope that helps with your custom Holocoat and your Magicard printer. Should you have any further questions then on support.magicard.com browse to your product. In the search you can start typing Holocoat and that will return all the solutions we currently have regarding everything to do with Holocoat. If you still haven't found a solution from there, inside your support account, you can create a new case, choose the printer, and in the support reason, choose printer upgrade, duo or holocoat. This will go directly to our support team who will be more than happy to answer any questions. Thank you for watching this video series and happy printing.